If sin hx is equal to 3, then show that x is equal to log 3 plus root 10 to the base e. This is very very important problem. It may be asked for M set entrance examination or JE mains also. So, it had better to do in careful manner. So, first let us solve it now. So, it can be solved using the formula sin h inverse x in terms of logarithmic function. So, now here given sin h x is equal to 3, we need to find x value. So, x is equal to sin h inverse 3, that means we need to find out sin h inverse of 3. So, now we have to recall the formula sin h inverse x is equal to log of x plus root of x square plus 1 to the base e. We have formulated this one, it has been formulated. So, using this now x can be written like this. Now, x is replaced by x for 3, we are substitute here in this one. So, we get log of 3 plus root of 3 square plus 1 to the base e. What here log of 3 plus root of 3 square is 9 plus 1 to the base e. So, this is log of 3 plus root 10 to the base e. Okay, suppose if sin h x is equal to 5, could you expect the value? Yes, why not? Here in the place of x replace 5, what do you get it now? 5 plus root of 5 square is 25 plus 1, 26, 5 plus root 26 you will get it. Let us solve that problem also for sake, sometimes it may be given in the examination. So, that means, suppose sin h x is equal to 5, what is the value of x question mark suppose. So, here x is equal to sin h inverse 5, am I correct? Using same principle, here x is replaced by 5. Now, we get x is equal to log of 5 plus root of 5 square plus 1 to the base e. Now, this equals to log of 5 plus root of 25 plus 1 to the base e. So, this equals to log of 5 plus root 26 to the base e. Similarly, even whatever value of sin h x is given x easily we can find out using inverse trigonometric functions formula. So, let us solve one more problem. Let me read the question. Show that tan h inverse of 1 by 2 equals to 1 by 2 times log 3 base e. So, with the help of tan h inverse x formula we can solve this problem. Here, we know that tan h inverse x equals to of log 1 plus x by 1 minus x to the base e. This is the formula. Replace x by 1 by 2. Now, we get tan h inverse 1 by 2 equals to 
आंख लॉग वन प्लस वन बाई टू बाई वन माइनस वन बाई टू टू द बेस ई लेट इट बी सिंप्लीफाइड आफ लॉग यर टू इज द एलसीएम टू प्लस वन टू माइनस वन बाई टू इज टू टू गेट्स कैंसल हेयर बेस ई वॉट यू गेट इट आफ लॉग थ्री डिवाइडेड बाई वन और थ्री अपॉन वन टू द बेस ई दिस इक्वल टू आफ लॉग थ्री टू द बेस ई हेंस इट इज फ्रू ओके लेट अस सॉल्व दिस प्रॉब्लम सी ही आर गिवेन कॉस एच एक्स इक्वल टू सेक थीटा very interesting problem we have to change hyperbolic function in terms of circular trigonometric functions so we have one formula to prove this this is equal to this tan h square x by 2 equal to cos hx minus 1 by cos hx plus 1 so now this is the formula so now we can do this sum as like this tan h square x by 2 is equal to sec theta minus 1 by sec theta plus 1 we need to recall sec theta formula sec theta is equal to 1 by cos theta so now this equals to 1 by cos theta minus 1 upon 1 by cos theta plus 1 now this equals to cos theta 1 minus cos theta okay upon 1 plus cos theta upon cos theta cos theta cos theta gets cancelled we have 1 minus cos theta by 1 plus cos theta it's very interesting see this 1 minus cos theta equals to 2 sin square theta by 2 1 one plus cos theta is equal to 2 cos square theta by 2 these two formula we have to remember so now this is 2 sin square theta by 2 by 2 cos square theta by 2 2 2 2 what is sin theta by two? upon cos theta by two. that's nothing but tan of theta by 2 so we get this is nothing but sin square theta by 2 by cos square theta by 2 is tan square theta by 2 so what has to be proved tan square theta by 2 yes we have proved this equal to Are just.